So there's two worlds of strength training. There's the Western world and then there's the Eastern world. In the Western world of strength training, it's pretty much what we all know, bench press, squat, barbells, dumbbells, you name it. It's fantastic for building strength, but in a linear plane of motion, which leaves a lot of cracks in your foundation. Now, I'm not knocking Western strength training. I grew up doing barbell and dumbbell work. I think it's fantastic. But I do know that a lot of guys come to me after years of barbell work dealing with aches and pains. Not to mention that Western strength training has really been around for like, what, less than a century? It's rather new. Then there's Eastern strength training, which dates back thousands of years, even to the origins of human civilization. Eastern strength training is what you see me do. Tools like kettlebells, clubs, and maces primarily focus on joint health in the shoulders, spine, and hips first before building muscle on top of that foundation. This is why most people can barely swing a 25 pound mace, even if they bench press 400 pounds. It's because they built a lot of strength on top of a weak foundation. In my strength coaching program, I specifically only use Eastern styles of strength training with my clients. First, we address and eliminate the pain and dysfunction. And from there, we start packing on muscle and make them stronger and more athletic than ever. And they don't even have to go to a gym, especially if you're a martial artist. This is the way to a better body.